Surveillance video always needs to consider bandwidth availability and storage space. So compressing the video is highly beneficial. If you cap the desired bitrate to a set value, it becomes very easy to predict the maximum need for storage over time. The problem with this maximum bitrate is that you could end up spending a lot less bandwidth than planned and still suffer from lower quality than expected during peak hours. Now, if you apply a variable bitrate, the compressor tries to maintain a certain level of quality. This means bitrate is kept low during off hours but rises with increasing activity. Your storage is spent more wisely, but it becomes harder to predict exactly how much storage you will need. A codec based on average bitrate does things differently. You start by setting a desired bitrate over time that matches your storage capacity. The compressor keeps track of the historical bitrate usage, and if it's lower than the set value, quality is increased. When the average bitrate increases and comes close to the target value, quality is adjusted down to not exceed it. Over time, this will give you the maximum amount of quality for a predictable amount of bandwidth and storage.